Hey, what's up guys? This is Darkroom Duelist, and today I've got a, actually a structure deck opening for you guys. It's been a while since I've done this. And today I went out and bought a box of Synchro Extreme because of all the amazing reprints in this deck. And plus, I was actually looking for some Plague Spreader Zombies, and they were just like, here, Dark Arm Duelist, have some Plague Spreaders. So anyways, guys, let's get into this deck and see what we can get. I mean, I know everything's the same, but let's go over a couple of the cards that are in here. Um, I mean, you get a Junk Warrior in every box. I think you get an Effect Veiler in every single box. Um, you get a Solemn Warning. I mean, there's just some really, really great reprints. But um, let me get out the playmat, and we'll actually do the opening on top of that. All right, that is our playmat. Our playmat is got a big Stardust Warrior on it, which is the new Stardust card, which there is quite a few new cards in this set, which is really, really cool. I'm not gonna go over the combo guide or anything like that. Um, you get a deck list and everything, but let's get into what the cards we get, if I don't have to fight this the whole time. Um, let me just move this out of the way. I mean, it looks cool, but it's getting in my way. So let's move this out of the way. Um, first off, you get one copy of Stardust Warrior. It is a really, really cool card. Um, it prevents your opponent from special summoning cards, and it's just a really great card. I mean, I love it. The art is awesome. And actually, if you look closely at the leg, you can see that it's actually Yusei, in my opinion. I mean, other people may say it's not, but it's actually, in my opinion, it's Yusei inside of this Stardust armor. But um, yeah, you get one copy of Stardust Warrior. You get one copy of Jet Warrior, which is a really, really cool card. Um, you get one Jet Synchron. You get one Scrap Fist, which is the attack that actually Junk uh, Warrior uses. Um, you get one Excel Synchron, which I think that's five super rares you get, which is really cool. Uh, I think this is a new card. I'm not sure. Correct me if I'm wrong. But uh, Rush Warrior, I think he's actually new. I don't think he was printed in any other sets. Uh, Rush Warrior is new. Um, uh, Synchron Carrier, it is also new, but it's a really, really neat card. You get two copies of Junk Synchron, which I think was Yusei's pretty much signature tuner that he could go into the majority of his Synchro monsters with. Um, you get one Quick Draw Synchron, which is an amazing card. I actually use it in my Cyber Dragon deck. Um, then you get a Drill Synchron, which they're just including all the Synchron cards because this deck is inspired by Yu uh, Yusei Fudo from the Yu-Gi-Oh! 5D series, which is actually my favorite series of Yu-Gi-Oh! Because um, it came out with Black Wings. Uh, you get one Turbo Synchron. You get one Unknown Synchron, which is really cool. I think it's Floral Synchron, which um, is a video game card, actually, that came with... Um, I don't remember what the Synchro version of it was, but you get one of them. Uh, I think it's Synchron Exploder. Uh, you get a Speed Warrior, which was actually Yusei's, one, another one of Yusei's signature card. He would use Junk Synchron and Speed Warrior to go into Junk Warrior all the time. You get a Sonic Warrior, which is kind of a garbage card. Doppel Warrior for those uh, Quasar decks. Uh, Cobalt Hedgehog. Uh, Tuning Wear. Really cool card. Uh, I see a lot of people use this in a, um, what's it called deck? They use it in um, Quasar decks. You get one Swift Iron Scarecrow, which is an awesome, awesome card. Uh, a Level Eater, another great Quasar card. And then we'll get into one of the actual really great reprints, and that is Effect Failure. Effect Failures used to go for like $5 a piece, I think, or so. And then with this, you can get an Effect Failure for maybe 2 bucks now. But with the deck, you get an Effect Failure for like 10 with a bunch of extra cards. So, I mean, it's, it's awesome that they included this. Um, you get a Gen X Neutron, which has only ever had one other reprint, and that was out of the Megatons. Um, Gen X Ally Birdman, which I think is a great, great reprint. I really wish this would come back to more than one. And then here's my favorite reprint that they included in the whole deck, and that is a Plague Spreader Zombie, because this is my favorite tuner in the entire game, besides, you know, my Blackwing stuff, because Plague Spreader Zombie is so versatile in the game that, you know, you can make Beals with him, you can make Void Ogre with him, and you know, I just think he's a great reprint. I'm going to definitely be buying three of these structure decks. And then you get one each for the Wyvern Busters and the uh, Collapse Serpents. Um, this is actually really interesting that they included these because they are actually really great for uh, Synchroing. And that, that's it for the uh, monsters. Then you get a Limiter Override, which is also a new card. 
Um, it lets you return one tuner synchro monster and one non-tuner synchro monster. You control your extra deck, special summon one synchro monster from your extra deck that has a level equal to the combined monsters. So basically, it lets you synchro summon on your opponent's turn because it's a quick play. Uh, then you get one Starlight Junction, which I think is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful card. Um, it's just a great card. You can tribute one um, tuner monster, special summon one synchron monster from your deck with a different level than the tributed monster had on the field. During your opponent's turn, if you special summon a synchro monster from your extra deck, which combos with limiter overdrive, um, target one card on the field and shuffle it into the deck, which is a really, really awesome card. Uh, then you get one tuning, which is the, the uh, basically the rota. Speaking of rota, you get a rota too. It's basically the rota for synchron cards. Uh, it lets you add a synchron card from your deck turn end. That's why I'm definitely going to be buying three of these. Uh, you get one re warrior returning alive, uh, one dark eruption. Excuse me, I dropped that. Really cool. Let you recycle a lot of your dark cards. You get one one for one. <laughs> ha ha. One one for one. Um, another cool reprint. You get a night beam. You get a du um, double cyclone. A Scrap Iron Statue. If you've ever watched the Yu-Gi-Oh! 5D series, this was actually made in the 5D series. And it's actually a really good card. Um, it's just really, really cool. Uh, you get a Scrap Iron Scarecrow, which is, was actually Yusei Fudo's signature trap card. You get a Limiter Overload. You get a Call of the Haunted. And then one of the really, really cool reprints is an Imperial Iron Wall. This card actually went up because of Worlds. And I actually could see it getting at least maybe semi-limited, maybe limited, because it shuts down a lot of decks nowadays. But I love this card, and it is just amazing. I sideboard it most of the time. You know, I know I don't so show my sideboard a lot, but this is definitely in my sideboard most of the time. Uh, and then one of my really cool, you know, I thought it was really cool that they reprinted it, and that's Solemn Warning. Uh, Solemn Warning, <laughs> you needed, I guess, another reprint of it, and it makes it really common but with me building so many decks, I'm buying a lot of these because of the effect veilers, the solemn warnings, night beams, all that sort of stuff. And plus, I would actually like to make a Quasar deck. And then you get one of Yusei Fudo's signature synchros, and that is a Junk Warrior. Um, overall, I think this structure deck is great. If you haven't picked up one, I would definitely recommend at least picking up one, uh, if not three. I'm definitely going to be buying three of this just for the Stardust Warriors and the reprint. Um, anyways, guys, this is Darkroom Duelist. I hope you enjoyed this, uh, I guess, Structure Duck analyst and discussion. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, but this is Darkroom Duelist, and I'm signing out. See you later, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe.